Hello, Painting with a Purpose friends. Um, I just wanted to hop on here and I thought about this last night um, while I was trying to sleep and I just wanted to show you how you can kick up any painting a notch. So how you can make it a little more fun. Um, so I'm going to show you on several different paintings how you can add just a little bit of detail and it really brings a lot more life to your painting. So to do this, you're going to need your small round brush and um, my favorite metallic paint this is my favorite metallic paint but i did end up finding some other gold metallic paint um also so either one is fine and we're just gonna see if i can get this open ah, there we go so we're just gonna add it's a little different color i don't know if you guys can tell one's a little brighter one's more a little darker here i'll put them together like that but they're, they'll, either one will work. All right, so here's what we're gonna do to the unicorn to kind of kick it up a notch. So in between here, your color, you can just add a thin line of gold. So in between when the color switches like your ombre, you can just add some gold. And this just kind of makes it a little more fun. You can also add the gold in these spaces that we created. My kitty cat's gonna help me today. Um, you can also outline your bow in gold. And it just kind of kicks it up a notch. So that's the unicorn one. Let me show you how you can kick up the red lady, the red hat society. So if you have yellow hair, you can just add some gold streaks through her hair. Um, if you don't have yellow hair, you can still do it in the hair. You can also just come in here and add a little bit of gold in her lips just to kind of kick it up a notch all right so let me show you another one the flower one this is really my favorite i am so happy at how it turned out so this one you can do lots of things you can add your gold um, in your flower so if you wanted to add you know, some gold through your flower. And then if you, I love how like ideas come to me while I'm supposed to be sleeping. Um, if you want to come in here and in between these color spaces, and add some gold just here and there not everywhere and you just kind of follow the line You can add some gold in the leaf. And see, so it just kind of brings a little more life. And you can really add metallic to any painting and it'll just kick it up a notch. Okay, let me show you a couple more that I have here. So you can kind of see those gold lines where the colors are separated and you can add as much or as little as you want. So this cute little kid's owl 
for Valentine's Day that um, I did a while back. So if you wanted to add gold, you could outline your hearts in gold. You can also put a little gold in the eyes. Just to kind of kick it up a notch. And last but not least, I'm gonna show you really quick is this um, Valentine's Day tree. So if you wanted to add gold in here, you could just swirl some through your flowers once they're dry. Maybe not everywhere, just real simple swirl. And so when you look at it, it's gonna shimmer in the light. You can also add, if you did the heart vines, so you can also add like just a little bit of gold down one side of the heart. These are really small, so don't do too much. But let's see, can you guys see that? So I just swirled some gold through the flowers and then added some gold to the hearts. So really metallic is an, a, a wonderful thing to use to kind of kick up any painting to just add a little bit more to it. Um, but I just wanted to show you guys that. So have fun painting, be creative.